Hey YouTube, this is We All Juggle Knives and I've got some uh, itty bitty teeny weeny mini uh, Schrade everyday carry folders. Um, this is the 303M, all right, and the 304. And uh, so how small are these? Well, let, let's take a look at the shadow of Big Brother eclipsing them. This is the Big Brother of these, all right, the 303. Okay, so you see, a lot of people said that the 303, you know, this thing is like 9 ounces. Solid stainless steel handle. It's just, it's heavy, it's huge, it's a tank. But a lot of people said this is too heavy. So they came out with these. If you want something light, easy to carry, less than 3 ounces. Alright, so they did listen to you. Now these little knives are super light, and they're also very slim. You can see flow through open pillar construction, non-tubed lanyard hole. Right, these knives are all about convenience. This is something, if you have little cutting tasks uh, around, around an office or something, it's unobtrusive, it's, it's small, you know, the blade length is only 2.6 inches, so it gets under a lot of various restrictions in different places. The main difference on these models is simply the handle. This gives you the completely clean look, right? This gives you a little more texture with these grooves there. Okay, so it's you know it's just a matter of what is your preference. As far as deployment, thumb studs, and even though these are small knives, you saw the deployment. The deployment was easy, and even with the left hand deployment was still easy. Now the steel on these is uh, 9CR18 MOV stainless and you see the designs here these are extra wide uh, for their length drop points with partial hollow grinds. Now the price tag on these I checked it at Knife Center it was like fourteen dollars I mean come on that is I mean, 14 bucks. This is a nice little knife for that price. You know, I have a Buck Nobleman, it, which is a great small knife. Uh, but the Buck Nobleman was like, I don't know, it was like 25 or $30. Uh, same idea as these, but these, you know, 14 It's a, it's a nice handy little pocket knife. Now, as you can see, these are frame locks. There's the lock up there. The big danger with designing a small frame lock, you know, something that fits in the palm of your hand literally, is that it might be difficult to open because, you know, sometimes if you're accidentally pressing on the bar, it can be a pain. Um, but these are very easy to open. Like I said, I can even open it left handed or right handed. Uh, usually, frame locks can be difficult on the left side but not so with this knife. My final conclusions on these knives, number one, I'm glad they actually listened to people that said some of their knives were getting too heavy. Now they give you options. Uh, I really like the just the basic designs from just how they look. Uh, I like the drop point that's extra wide, gives you good curvature and it's a strong tip. I like that they're so slim. I like that they're less than three ounces. And the price is right, you know, it would be hard to find something of the same price um, that works as well. And the deployment is everything you could want from a frame lock of this size. I was surprised that there was no problems with deployment. I would say as a usable, convenient little lightweight pocket knife, easy to carry uh, around an office somewhere, you need to open packages, just an everyday cutting tool. Yeah, these would be great. I mean, the price is right. Would actually be a really good gift, too. I could see this used by men or by women as well. So, yeah, overall, these are pretty much a bargain. All right, I'm trying to keep things short and sweet. Hope you enjoyed this overview. This has been We All Juggle Knives. I'm out.